And some people are still waiting hours just to get a test. From long lines wrapping around buildings in California to packed parking lots at drive through sites in Connecticut. Look, this is a problem all across the country. CNBC's Bertha Combs reports tonight on how one company is offering a high-tech solution and not just for testing sites. Waiting in line is now part of COVID life. Retailers like Lululemon adopted virtual wait lists so people could reserve a spot before they shop. More than 300,000 signed up last fall. Demand also strong at Brookfield Properties malls. When we launched in October, double-digit growth uh, with our tenants adopting and using the platform. And then triple-digit usage uh, increase uh, when, we, when we went into Black Friday. Welcome to Wait While. The company behind their virtual wait lists, four-year-old startup Wait While, which got its start managing crowds for events like the Tribeca Film Festival, but now has become a go-to for social distancing. We have quadrupled our growth. COVID, you know, I, I guess provided a lot of activation energy for that shift to happen in a time frame that would otherwise have taken probably five, five to seven years. Hartford Health System uses WaitWhile to keep patients' families in the loop when they're having surgery, critical this year during COVID restrictions. A lot of times it's call a phone number and what if someone doesn't pick up um, or you can't reach someone at all. This platform allows us to have two-way communication that the uh, family members are actually able to communicate back with us if they have any questions or if they're nervous. CDMD went virtual with the Xperity platform to combat long COVID testing lines this winter. I was very concerned about people waiting in the cold. Wait while hopes the practice sticks. Even after COVID, you know, having people more uh, be more aware of what the wait time is before they even choose to go to an office or a space. Just as using video conferencing and telemedicine have changed our expectations about how we can do meetings or visit doctors, virtual wait lists are also an eye opener about how to make the experience of waiting easier for both sides and setting expectations contest. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.